Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Photosynthesis. During photosynthesis, plants absorb sunlight and carbon dioxide from the air. Through a series of steps, much like cellular respiration, they convert these reactants into the products oxygen and glucose. The plants then can use the oxygen and glucose to make ATP in cellular respiration. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Cellular respiration does not depend on light. Photosynthesis does depend on light. Cellular respiration takes place during the daytime and during the nighttime. Cellular respiration goes on inside of plant cells, regardless if light is shining on the plant or not. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Plants need oxygen to survive, and plant cells are constantly using oxygen. Respiration in plants is like photosynthesis run backwards. Instead of capturing energy by manufacturing sugars and releasing oxygen, cells release energy for their own use by breaking down sugars and using up oxygen. Make your mark, take our lead. Plants make glucose in their leaves and they use some of it for respiration. Glucose is converted into cellulose for making cell walls. Making proteins, glucose is combined with nitrates collected from the soil to make amino acids, which are then made into proteins. Take our lead. Plants carry are both the processes, thus generating food and energy. In fact, cellular respiration is carried out continuously throughout their life, while photosynthesis is only carried out during the hours when sunlight is available. Take our lead. Mitochondria. As with photosynthesis, plants get oxygen from the air through the stomata. Respiration takes place in the mitochondria of the cell in the presence of oxygen, which is called, aerobic respiration. In plants, there are two types of respiration, dark respiration and photorespiration. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.